Hey guys, Zephyrus here. Today I'm going to be showing you all how to improve your FPS and performance and eliminate any sort of crashes and freezing you have experienced in the game. So let me quickly show you guys my gaming rig first. And I basically have i5-4570 as my CPU. So this should ensure that if you guys have a better CPU than me, you guys should be fine. And these methods should work for you because my CPU is from 2013. You guys can tell that it's very old. Basically, the first method is you want to go to Steam. You want to go to PathExile 2 in the library and you want to hit the scare box icon. And then you want to go to properties and then click on installed files. And they want to verify the integrity of game files. And this will fix any file corruption that is relating to the game. And yeah, so the second method is also actually on Steam. You want to go to the top left corner of your screen where you see the Steam logo, click on it. Then you want to go to settings. From there, you want to scroll down until you see in-game. And then you want to disable this option. Enable the Steam overlay while in-game. Because if you disable it, it will drastically improve the performance. Your CPU would be working less hard. So the next method is also on Steam. And basically what you want to do is you want to also hit this gearbox. You want to hit properties and you want to go to launch options. And basically you want to type these in. You want to type in dash dash no async. And this will ensure that your system wouldn't be loading all the textures assets while you're playing the game and could definitely reduce the workload on your CPU. Also, you want to type in this. This will eliminate any like usage of the logo inside the game. And lastly, is dash dash wait for preload. So this ensures that your Steam launcher would preload every file and assets and game textures before you load into the game. So your system doesn't have to work as hard. And hopefully this helps. All right, so the next method would work if you're using an NVIDIA GPU. You wanna go into the NVIDIA app, which they renamed it recently, and you wanna go down to settings, and you wanna disable NVIDIA overlay. And you guys might not think that this is gonna make a big effect, you know, it's just overlay, but trust me guys, I went from like 50 FPS to like 90 FPS using this option and really helped my FPS overall. And I didn't realize how much this actually affected my system performance. And this could also help reduce crashes. So the last way of increasing your FPS and fixing any errors regarding launching the game is by going to Task Manager and changing your game's compatibility mode. So basically like, I'll do example. You wanna right click on the game, .exe. Like this is just gonna be example. You wanna go to properties and you want to go to compatibility and run this compatibility for Windows 7. Usually that would work. This actually works because I have a friend who couldn't run League of Legends on his Windows 11 machine. As soon as he changed it to Windows 7 compatibility mode, it worked. So yeah, this should work for Path Exile 2 if it works for League of Legends. So, but anyways, hope this video helps. And if you have any concerns and questions, let me know in the comments. But yeah, that's basically it.